This is the story of Alice. Alice is 12 and is a very... She has many friends. They meet often and have family who love her. She's very active. She likes to play, dance, and has lots of interests. Then something changes. At night, Alice doesn't sleep well. She wakes often. She has nightmares. Sometimes she feels trapped in her bed. And during the day, she always feels tired. She falls asleep everywhere. Also, at school, she has trouble staying awake, and the teacher gets angry. <laughs> her classmates make fun of her. Alice feels more and more alone. Her parents bring Alice to the doctor. At the beginning, nobody understands, but finally, Alice meets a good doctor. Thanks to the tests at the sleep center, they discover the cause. Alice has narcolepsy. Narcolepsy is a neurological illness which causes an altered sleep pattern. The brain is unable to regulate the body functions and doesn't know when to rest and when to stay awake. The main symptom is daytime sleepiness, which is manifested as irresistible attacks of sleep that can occur at different moments of the day. You suddenly feel the need to sleep, even if you have other things to do, and you fall asleep often at unopportune moments. Another symptom characteristic of narcolepsy is cataplexy, which manifests as unforeseen episodes of loss of muscle strength provoked by an emotion, often a nice one like laughter or a surprise. Also, sleep is disturbed because of awakenings and falling asleep or on awakening visions can appear, often frightening like experiencing nightmares with open eyes. These are called hypnagogic hallucinations. Often these hallucinations are accompanied by the impossibility to move for some minutes. They are really shocking experiences called sleep paralysis. The body still sleeps but the brain is already awake. Today Alice feels better. Her doctors have helped her thanks to a correct diagnosis and the proper treatment. We have briefly presented with its main symptoms narcolepsy. Narcolepsy is a curable illness. If you recognize the symptoms that we have described, talk about them with your doctor or contact the sleep center nearest to you. 18 March 2010, First European Narcolepsy Day.